Hey, how's it going guys? This is Crafty Fox, and today we are making another New York City MTA bus. So this is the new Flyer Industries XD40, and it's a diesel bus. Uh, probably like one of the last buses I needed in my uh, bus fleet for um, the MTA right now. Uh, maybe there is also some older buses and express buses, but this is like pretty much like one of the last uh, major buses that I'm going to be making. Uh, so yeah, this is pretty much it for design. You may have seen the one where I think it's XD60 where they have like another part in the back. But this is like the regular version of it, I guess. So anyways, guys, let's get started. So let's first make the wheels. It's going to be um, black wool. So just put that down. And I wonder if, yeah, that's enough space, right? Maybe one more. So black wool down, skip two blocks in the middle, another black wool down. And then we're going to take uh, quartz and then add a 3x4 in front of it. So 3 blocks long, 4 blocks wide. And in front of that, uh, 4 block wide of this nether brick slab. So after we do that, that is appears to be 5. So uh, let's add some more quartz blocks. Let's add 11. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And you know what? Let's add 12. 12 like that. And let's do the other side. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Fill in the rest of the gap in the middle. It's going to be the flooring. You could change the color up, but I don't really have an interior of this, so it doesn't really matter. Then we're going to add a row of nether brick slabs in the back like that. And let's switch it up to... Uh, quartz block, so let's take out quartz block. Let's add a 3 by 4 in the back. So 3 blocks tall, 4 blocks wide. And then we're also going to take out bedrock, add a vent right here on this side. The other side, I don't think it has any, so we'll leave that alone. Let's go to the front. Let's add two lapis in the middle. And then we're going to add quartz block on the side, which I don't want quartz slabs. So quartz block like that, and then we're going to add three more lapis right here. And then we're going to take stone brick stairs, add one above the wheel for the wheelbarrow, and another one on the other side. Let's do the same thing. Then we're going to add two lapis azulis, and on the other side we'll just add one. Then we're going to go to the back, let's add two right here. And then uh, upside down stone bricks stairs like that. And then two more lapis. The other side, uh, I think it's just three lapis. Yeah, three lapis. Upside down stone brick stairs. And then one lapis. Okay, so let's add the wheels in the back. So I'm going to take uh, black wool, punch a hole right here where the wheel's supposed to be. Bam. And we're also going to take stone button, just add that on the sides of all our wheels like this. And also let's add the headlights as well like that. Alright, so next uh, we're going to take out, um, let's take out black stained glass block and add a 2x4 in the front like that for the front windshield. And then we're going to switch it up to black concrete for the window dividers. So on this side, all right, I think there's one lapis right here. Then uh, black concrete, two blocks tall. Let's add one right here, skip a block, another one. Have another one on this side. And then skip two blocks, another one right here. And we actually need to fill in this add space. So I'm going to use white concrete for that. Just fill in this uh, row in the middle here. And also on this side, add four, I think. One, two, three, four, and then we're going to leave these two alone for the door. So let's fill in the rest again with the black concrete. Like that. Same thing on both sides, pretty much. And then we're going to add um, quartz block in the back like this. And let's take out some black uh, glass and fill in this door right here. 
in all the spaces where the windows are supposed to be like that. Then this one. All right, and then we're gonna take out um, cobblestone wall, add one right here, and this is for the vent that sticks out. And next door, we're gonna add stone slab for the like the little vents, and then another uh, brick slab, and that's where the root number shows up. And we're also gonna take another brick slab, add a row in the front like this. Then we're gonna take wooden trap door, add one to the side right here. On top of it, we want a black carpet. And in front of that, we're gonna take uh, another brick fence like that. We're also gonna take a wither skeleton skull and add that to the side via mirror like this. So it's kind of hovering, but then we got to take out a lever so that it's sort of connected like that. And then uh, what else? Uh, let's work a bit on the back. We're gonna take a Minecraft sign, a license plate right there on the left side of the middle, then stone buttons for some tail lights. And above those buttons we're gonna add redstone torch, more tail lights. And uh, then we're gonna add a uh, quartz slab starting from this back door right here. So four blocks wide and just fill in all the space in the back with it. So it just goes all the way around. Then we're going to go to the front and then add a 2x2 two two quartz slab in the middle. And uh, right here in the back, let's add 1x2 quartz slab in the middle. Then we're going to take out um, this quartz stairs, have one face front like this. And then the rest, uh, they're going to be facing inwards until Actually, they're all facing inwards after that, so that's good. Let's just try to pop that in. And the other side. And then uh, we're going to have two more court stairs in the back, like this, facing back. And the rest of it is like this little box up here. I'm going to use quartz. Alright, so we are nearly completed. Let's add some more lights. So I'm going to use a uh, wooden button for turning lights. So there's going to be one behind this uh, front wheel, like that, then on both sides of the back wheel, on uh, both sides. And the other one, we're just going to add it right behind that first wheel. All right, so yeah, that is pretty much it on how to build the new Flyer XD40 Excelsior bus. I hope you guys enjoy this video, and if you do, please hit that like button below and subscribe if you haven't already because I will be uploading more videos like this in the future, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.